first shark attack in the region for at least two decades. Deaf and blind Australians are calling for equal access to the country's cinema screens. They say the slow expansion of captioning and audio description into movie theatres isn't nearly good enough. So today they staged a nationwide protest. They're also unhappy that major cinema chains have asked for an exemption from anti-discrimination laws while they upgrade their facilities. Deaf and blind Australians turned out across the country with a simple message. 100% access to all cinemas, all sessions, all around Australia, that's what we want. Protest group Action on Cinema Access says fewer than 1% of movies screened in Australia have captions or audio descriptions. 16-year-old Miranda Reardon loves horror films but finds it difficult to understand what's happening without captions. And I always feel left out when my friends talk about the movies we've just seen because I have no idea what's been going on. Reno Spadea just wants to enjoy a movie with his seven-year-old daughter. I want to be involved so that we can share what's going on in the movie and what's being said. So I miss out on a lot. I'd like to put more audio description. Surely when they make a movie, they should be able to put the audio description on it. Today's demonstrations come after the major cinema chains asked for exemption from the Disability Discrimination Act for two and a half years while they extend captioning and audio description services. In a joint submission to the Human Rights Commission, Hoyts, Greater Union, Village and Reading Cinemas said they proposed to increase the number of screens in cinemas operated by the applicants capable of delivering captions to 35 over the next two and a half years. They would also provide audio description capability in all of those 35 screens, including a retrofit of the current 12 cinemas offering captioning. Protesters say those proposals are not nearly enough. Only four minutes trying missing out by their family and friends who want to go with them. So there's probably eight to ten million people missing out as well. The four cinema chains were unavailable for comment. Kirsten Vaness, ABC News. You're watching ABC News Victoria.